Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install mods for 1.7.2, but it also works on 1.7.4, right? So first you open your, your Minecraft, let it load. Alright, so you brought this screen, right? And by default, you should have your Minecraft like 1.7.4, right? It updates automatically right, right here. No, like yours should say use latest version, right? But we're going to need to load 1.7.2 because that's how Forge is, right? Because it's picky that way. It's only been released for 1.7.2, but it's, uh, that version, 1.7.2, can be re used for 1.7.4, right? Because it's the um, 1.7.4 is just the, the patch version, like bug fixes. So once your Minecraft is loaded up, you can close it, like what I did is that I had just loaded up all the 1.7.2 files that Forge needed. So we're going to like Google Forge because this is like I'm like doing this um, as I go. Like I didn't install this before because this is like my point of view, of view for you guys. So then okay so once I'll put this link in the the description. Let me just copy and paste it. There we go. All right. So we're gonna use the latest. No, not the latest. Latest means that there it's like brand new, and the mods may not be compatible with it. We're gonna use the recommended one. Keep going to recommended two installer. There it is. Click it, and we want to stay on page because we want the download. It says please wait. Oh no. Yeah, it's supposed to be five seconds, so let's press back. Oop, nope. Okay, so 1.72 recommended. Install this one. There we go. There's a five seconds. Oh no, we don't want this guy talking. Let's pause it. Hey, go, go. Okay, let's make some money. No, I'm not making money. <laughs> Save the file. Wait until force downloads. Just depends on your download speed. Mine takes forever. Does it? I don't know. Yeah, it's really slow. Apologize for that. Oh no, it's fast now. It's a miracle. Hey, hey look, it's quick. Okay, so this is your like downloads page. I don't know where you find yours, but here's mine. This is Mozilla, by the way. I don't know if it's Google Chrome or Safari. Just find it. Just click the Forge. You'll get this um, window. Go to yeah the first option, install client. Click OK. It's downloading everything it needs for Forge. Doesn't take this long though. That's pretty weird. Maybe it's Windows 8 because this is my first time downloading mods for Windows 8, I think. It should be fine. Okay, there we go. It says install two libraries. Like that's what Forge needs. So you reopen your Minecraft. Okay. And then if you go to profile. Oh no, there's nothing. Okay, uh, why have my Minecraft options like return to window, right? So just reopen your Minecraft to see if you install Forge correctly. So we brought up this page, go to profile, and you see Forge. So you got Forge, you have to re-log in, and you can press play. And you see you have 1.7.2 Forge, press play. Da, 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 and we got Forge. There we go. You say if yeah if you see three mods loaded, then it tells you that you have Forge installed, right? Because all these stuff is the requirement for Forge. And to test that, you, darn Skype. Um, to test that this Forge is working, let's do like a test mod. Um, to have the test mod, we need to have Minecraft closed, right? Because you cannot have it open. So we're gonna do raise mini map because that's an easy mod to install for 1.7.2 sure how no i'm gonna go with nine minecraft because that's what i'm gonna do my mod series on I, I believe nine minecraft is like a safe download site for mods all right so wait until everything loads and we go here minecraft mod 1.7.2 right because forge is only updated for 1.7.2 um all these mods uh, you can install and I'll like show more tutorials on how to install these so stay tuned for that series okay um so apparently um 
Ray's minimap cannot be installed during my way. Like I looked it up on the actual forum, it says you cannot just like drag and drop the normal way with the uh, the, the, the 1.7 Minecraft update, right? Because that's why it took a while for the the Minecraft to have a modded uh, forge ready. So I guess we can't install Ray's minimap. So let's try something easy. Like I think it's the small mods, or I don't know. Just stick around to my like mod tutorials then I can show you which mods are compatible with these uh, stuff so I'm gonna look like this one more nature's mod this one I know I tested before that it's um compatible I guess like um it has let's figure it out what's in this mod so first we need to go to this download link click the blue download don't click this oh look we got spam one just close the spam which is like this, this is like gonna check it. So we got the more nature mod jar. Click save, and it's downloaded. Mozilla's on the top right. Google Chrome's on the bottom left. I just realized, and it's downloaded. Right. So I'll just open. Well, you can drag and drop. If you can't do that, then just go to open containing folder, right? Because it's right there. Now you need to go to your mods folder. To do that, you have to go to the right. Well, I'm using Windows 8. You just search it up. And, oh, it's loading hard. Okay, um, do your percent app data percentage. Press enter, and we have the dot Minecraft, and we have a mods folder, right? Because you open Minecraft, you have a mods folder. Double click it, and it's empty. Sweet, that's good news. It's supposed to be empty, and you drag your more nature mod inside. Perfect. Run your Minecraft, and while well, it loads, okay, so. Most, the majority of the mods should be able to do that, like to drag and drop into your mods folder. Ray's Minimap does not do that, apparently. Maybe it's the new update that affected it, but um, to install it, you have to like, go to the other file, which I, it's, uh, it, you look it up on YouTube. Like, there's lots of videos on how to do it. This, uh, this is the easiest way for like new modders. So go to your profile, Forge, right? Because Forge have like all the mods loaded. Press play. Let it load. It should take a while. What? Oh, okay. Hmm. Using it doesn't take this long, but I just noticed that my computer's been on for a couple of hours. That was taking too long. And what? Oh, we're on 1.6.4. Oh, I get it. Okay. When you select Forge. Make sure it's the uh, well. If you install Forge before, you didn't know what to do before. Like right here, it says 1.6.4. We have to go to your edit profile and use version. Go to the one that we installed, right? Because that's 1.7.2 version. Then you save profile, and right there, you have 1.7.2. Because some mods well, for 1.7.2 maybe not be compatible with the 1.6.4 mods. So be cautious of that. Like I just opened Forge. Just like we installed, I just remember that you can change your your profile. Okay, okay. So we have oh, there we go. We have four mods loaded. If you go to your mods tab, you can see there's a more nature mod, and let's uh test it out because I don't actually I didn't actually like, go see it. Um, let's create a new world. Creative it is. More options. Um, 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 um looks cool. Create a new world. And you let it load. Let's see what's in this. Or oh, actually, uh, um, 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 this will be like uh, the mod tutorial sample. That sample, like this was this will be the format. I won't tell you how to install the uh, the mod just because I'll I'll just link to this video. That's all. And as you can see, all the mods are loaded. World's being dumb right now. See skeleton. Oh, okay, a creeper. Okay, is it loaded? Okay, so as we're nearing the uh, the planes, I know of some spawns in the planes. Oh, there we go. We got butterflies. Yeah. Okay. So we got butterfly added to the game now. I don't think they drop anything. And oh, look, there's crickets now. They're like bigger than usual. That's the only problem. <laughs> like you expect them to be like, really, really small. Um, what other 
mobs are there? I think, oh yeah, the centipede. Um, centipede is like in the forest, and I believe there's like another mob inside the um, the swamp, and that'll be the moth. So, all right, so that's all. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.